What makes a memorable first impression? One that captures attention and ignites a desire to know more. What if you could create an unforgettable impression and do it simply? No expensive designers, no steep learning curve. Well, now you can. Whether it's for you or for your clients, you can now design with Uzi. Create a brand, an image, your online identity. All drag and drop simple with over 1 million free images and tons of templates to choose from. Just pick and customize. It's professional level graphics manipulation at your fingertips. So, next time you want to create a lasting impression, just reach for Usign and see how remarkable it can be when you're the designer. Hi, Bertrand here and welcome to Usign 2.0, the next evolution in digital marketing with desktop applications, mobile applications and our groundbreaking API integrations, Usign is now the ultimate graphic software for digital marketers. All right, so I'm just going to log in into my Usign account here. Um, this is my own personal account, so you'll see I have already a lot of designs with you. As you can see, I'm using the desktop version here. Uh, on Mac OS. So um, this is my dashboard where I have access to all the designs that I have saved over time and created in Usign. As you can see there is a wide vari variety of marketing graphics here and that's really what Usign allows you to do to have all your brand, all your marketing graphics in one single place. So let me show you some of the formats which are available in, in the latest version of Usign. So you have Facebook ads and, and Facebook cover photos, obviously, uh, Twitter covers, YouTube channel, Google Plus headers, uh, Pinterest, pins and, and boards. Um, you have web banners for all the most uh, common uh, dimensions you usually get for web banners. Uh, we have com cards, uh, prints, so under prints we have business cards, coupons, flyers, gift certificate, loyalty cards, Teespring t-shirts, uh, tickets. Um, we have Kindle covers, ebook covers, infographics, video and uh, header graphics as well. So um, as you can see we can start with uh, by creating a Facebook ad. I want to give you a demo and show you how that works. All right, so I'm going to go first to my uploads and inside my uploads, I have access to all the images I've uploaded in the past. And I'm going to set this image as a background. As you see, it only took one click to set any image as a background. And now I've added my logo. I'm going to set the opacity down and do a preview. And here we go. This is how it will look on Facebook. As you can see, you know, it just took me just a few seconds to create this ad. I'm going to save it. And when you save something, it will save um, on the Usign website. And if you're using the desktop version, you can retrieve uh, your designs as well. And um, that'll be it for this first design. So I'm just going to show you a few examples of, you know, how you would use uh, Usign in, in, in your actual business. Uh, so I'm going to create a new folder here um, in my Usign dashboard and I'm going to call it something like new design. So folders are useful to categorize your designs and that's really what we want to give you in Usign, the power to um, organize your brand in one single interface. So I just moved that image that we just created to the new design folder here. So now let's move on to the next design type. And uh, I'll, I'll show you more um, how, how Usign works. So uh, I'm just going to have a text layer for a start. So in this case, I'm going to design an ebook cover. This is the format I've selected. Uh, so I have my text layer. Next, I'm going to have the background and use the one click set as background button. And that sets the background right away. 
Okay, so now we're going to do a little bit of uh, text editing and customizing. Um, this will give me a chance to show you um, some of the, the amazing text uh, editing features we built in uh, Usain 2.0. All right, so now um, I can do various things. Um, I could add uh, a border to this, text, to this text layer, so I just done that. And now um, I'll change the text color, obviously. And um, we introduced shadows and borders in, in the latest version of Usain. So now you can set um, a shadow by tweaking the opacity, the distance and the angle to any text layer or any images. Now I'm gonna add uh, the author name at the, at the bottom of the, the book cover. And I'm just gonna tweak this a little more and uh, uh, until we get um, a good design. So as you can see, it's starting to take shape. And um, the, the good thing with using at this stage is that it's, it's incredibly easy to use. It's, it's really powerful. It's got all the features you would expect in a graphic software, but in a simple interface and, and we've been really focused on helping digital marketers. So some of the features you'll see are uh, pretty unique to us, um, like the numerous previews that we have. Um, in the second, I will show you um, the ebook cover preview and how you can turn this flat image into uh, a magazine cover, a ring binder cover, uh, an art book cover or or even a Kindle cover. So I'll just show you that in a second here. Um, I'm going to finish adjusting my text. So here you go. I just click on the preview button and now I have different types of previews available. And please note, we just keep on adding those previews. You know, we'll, uh, we're probably going to add more type to uh, the ebook. And you can also download the preview to your desktop if you want to use that in your marketing, obviously. Or you can download the flat version from here. Um, but now let's save this design. We can consider it as done and we'll just move on to the next thing. And that's a great thing with design. You can just get really creative, um, get your designs created in a few seconds and, and move on to the next one. So I'll go back to my dashboard and I'm going to move this design to the, uh, the folder that I've just created for, for this example. Now let's create a, a Facebook cover, you know, so we'll, uh, we'll go through that and I'll show you some of the other features in Usain 2.0 at the same time. Um, so I'm using the Pixabay integration here and um, I've just loaded an image and I'm going to set the image as the background. So with the Pixabay integration and the icon finder and stock and limited integration, you get access to about 1.3 million images right inside Usain. And that's on top of the hundreds of images that we have created at Usain, which are in the software. Uh, now I'm demoing the guide feature. So as you can see with the smart guides, um, you can see where your um, picture will be located. And I'm doing a preview now of the, of the Facebook cover. Um, but yeah, with smart guys, you can, you, you, these are the blue lines you can see on the screen. And with this, you can see where, um, where to place your elements, where the, the, the image will appear on Facebook and, um, and so on. So now let's choose another image from Pixabay and uh, we're gonna erase the background of it. And uh, you can do that within Usain. It's incredibly easy to do. To do. I'm going to show you just how right now. So you want to select with the green uh, brush um, the area that you want to keep. So I'm just going to do that roughly now. And with the red brush, you select the area you want to remove. And as you see, it doesn't take a lot of tweakings. That took me pretty much uh, 15 seconds to remove uh, the background from that flower image. All right, so I'm going to move things around and um, we're going to finalize this design little by little. So I can use uh, various editing functions like uh, you can duplicate layers, you can center layers, you can, you can flip layers around. Um, you can obviously undo and redo. 
and I'm gonna add a third um, flower right at the top and I'm gonna flip it um, vertically so that it fits nicely. All right, and so now I can apply a filter effect. So I'm gonna go for a vignette effect. And now if I click on preview, I can see how it will look on my uh, fan page or my personal page. And you can always download the previews, you know, if you work with clients or if you want to have a visual, you know, impression of how your things will look. Um, so next, uh, I want to show you some of the graphics in Usign. So we, we, we are constantly adding to this library pretty much every day. Um, we're adding the kind of graphics that, that you may need in your business. So um, now let's, let's try uh, to add this rainbow here and I will show you how you can customize the colors um, of, of, of this rainbow. So first I'm gonna add a, a shadow to this uh, graphic, to the rainbow graphic. So as you can see, it's starting to stand out and turn down the opacity a bit. And now if I click on this color icon, I can change all the individual colors of this image. And that applies to all the graphics types uh, built by the Usign team that you'll find in Usign. You can really get very, very creative with the colors and um, really make them match your brand. So as you can see, it's incredibly easy. I can just pick any color from the canvas and change the colors of my, of my rainbow. So next we have objects, uh, occasions, uh, people, images, uh, we have shapes, technology. So this will be like a iMac and, and MacBook and, and iPhone uh, mockups. Then we have web elements. Um, we have the icon finder integration. So I'm just gonna show you that quickly. So if I just type flower or any keyword in icon finder, um, you will get, um, uh, uh, a list of all the results in, in icon finder related to that search so then you can just click on any of these images and, and add it to your to your design uh, we have pixabay integration stock and limited integration which is more like vector graphics uh, you have your uploads your upload tab where you can upload your own images so just click on, on upload and as you can see you can just drag and drop any image there um, there's the filters as well, which we saw earlier on. And we also have um, a way to save group of, of, of images together. So I'm just going to group those three flowers together, as you can see. And then if I click on group here, it's going to lock them together. Now, the next thing I might want to do is to actually save this group so that I can reuse it in a future design or whenever I need. And that's what you can do with the save group feature. So as you can see on the left here, uh, my group has been saved. And if I click on it, I'm just gonna restore it to the, uh, to the canvas. So that's the power of save groups. You can use that for you know, saving your, your buy buttons or some of your key branding material so that you can reuse it in any of your user designs. And we're pretty much done for this design. It's, it's looking very great. And as you can see, it took us like less than, than five minutes to do this. So Usign has all the formats and, and, and I guess that's really one of the big strength of the software is that we keep track of, of all the latest uh, formats for graphics online. So you can easily access those from the Usign editor. So now I'll save my design once again and it will get added to my, um, to my dashboard in Usign. All right, and it's here already. So I'm just gonna move it to the new design folder again. And that's it. As you can see, I was just about to create three very nice looking designs in, in no time, thanks to Usign. And um, I wanted to also show you how the uh, WordPress integration works in Usign. So um, if I go to my WordPress blog and, and click on, um, on, on edit a post, 
I can insert any of my Usain image directly. So I'll just select the insert from Usain tab in WordPress. Uh, you'll need to install the Usain WordPress plugin. And I have instant access to the images that I've just created a minute ago. Um, so that's really is the power of the WordPress plugin. It's, it comes free with Usain and it's a great addition. And something you should keep in mind as well is that any update that you make in Usain will reflect in real time on your WordPress site. So as you can see, that was incredibly easy to just add those images to WordPress. And besides WordPress, we have numerous integration, um, like our smart member integration, um, the social, social service integration, and so on. Usain also come with a fully featured help desk where you have dozens of tutorials, video tutorials. Um, you have all the information about the various integrations uh, we have added to Usain. Um, you have access to the webinar replays and also all the downloads so the Usain desktop, Usain for iOS and so on. And from the help desk, you may also um, ask your questions, uh, communicate with other members, give your ideals and you know we're really looking forward to hearing from you there when you buy usine today you are backed by a 100 percent 60-day money back guarantee this is an exclusive special offer for usine to celebrate our one year anniversary and simply click on the buy button below to get instant access now to usine 2.0 thank you for watching and have a great day